Hey, how's it going? So I got uh, an email today from someone at the World Food Program asking me a really common question. So I thought uh, in this video I would show you how to easily remove text from a background image. I don't know if you can see the email that I got. So basically it's a woman walking to the vehicle. So the text in the lower left hand corner is the text that they would like me to remove. And this is one of those things that in the even a year or two ago, I may have gone into Photoshop and uh, done a couple of things that I've been doing, you know, for many years. But there's actually an easier way now. And I always check because I feel like new apps and uh, websites and whatever are constantly uh, being introduced. So I wanted to show you this one that I just came across. I'm just using uh, because I like to, especially living and working in the developing world where people don't always have access to expensive software programs like Photoshop, uh, as much as I love it, uh, I wanted to show how to do that with a free program. So I just did a Google search, something like remove text from image free online program or in a lot of apps came up as well if you're working on your phone and not on the computer. So um, I came up with this one, Fotor. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it. Remove text from image online for free. I love it. So let's try. Let's see how it works. Remove text now. Drag or upload your images. All right, so it's making me do a, a free trial, but for now, I'm just going to go with the free plan. So I'm going to go do that and then I'll be right back. All right, I am the proud owner of a free three day trial at uh, Fodar. Just a little life hack. I use uh, the um, to do list app called Todoist. And uh, whenever I sign up for any kind of free trial, I know I will forget if I don't write it down. So I just pop it in my calendar maybe one or two days. Uh, before and actually here it actually tells you to uh, cancel the free subscription 24 hours before the free trial ends so anyway just a little life hack just pop it in your calendar to check with check in with yourself if you want to keep it or not so that you know to um, cancel your free trial before you get charged if you don't want to continue and have this thing now for the year um, it actually seems like a pretty decent price though anyway all right so let's go for it so I'm going to uh, let's see, did I download this? Hold on. I did. Okay. So you want to open up the image that you want to remove the text from. So we are ready to get rid of our text. So I'm going to focus on the object remover. By the way, if you're interested in what other, these other things do, this looks like a really cool program, actually. Um, you can always click on these little um, question marks and they'll give you more information. So we're using the object remover. As you can see, it's not just for text, it's for full on dogs in this case, but it could be a fly on the wall, it could be text, could be someone's foot, whatever it is that you wanna get rid of. So what we're gonna do is we're going to smear um, the thing that we wanna take out. So let's do that first. And um, yeah, so let's do that. So we go inside here. And I'm going to draw over the, this area that we want to get rid of. Um, it is optional that if we use the eraser, if we want to like, oops, oh gosh, I just did a command Z. <laughs> if you want to kind of go get in there more tightly, you can. I usually, if I'm going to do this really accurately, I would zoom in. I'm just doing this rather quickly though. So let's see how this works. All right, so let's do start removing. All right, there you go. That worked perfectly and saved me loads of time. If I had done that in Photoshop, I would have done it with like the cloning tool and the smudge and it might have taken me at least, you know, I don't know, 10 to 30 minutes depending, but uh, that was pretty quick and painless, no? So, wow, love it. Okay, great. I, so far, free trial is definitely worth the money. All right, I'm going to hit apply and that's it. I'm going to download this and I can send it to the World Food Program and they can use it on their social media.
Let me just confirm that in fact it did download and yeah, perfect. I'm gonna send this in and now they can use it. I actually didn't do anything else to this image. I might just like adjust the um, levels a little bit, but I'm just gonna send it back to them just as they gave it to me. So um, Fotor is the name of the program. You can use it for free for three days. Uh, it looks like they have really inexpensive monthly and yearly plans as well. and. <laughs> anything that saves me time and energy uh, is okay in my book. So yeah, this is giving, getting two thumbs up for me. All right. I hope this was helpful. Take care.